Thank you. All right, for people making hot meals, uh, got to be careful this weekend. Going to be a lot of cooking going on. Doctors say cooking, the main cause of home fires uh, this time of year, very common around Christmas. So, Kelly Hubbard talked to a burn expert explaining what we all need to kind of know before we prepare to make those big meals because we just want the food, not the injuries. Kelly, good morning. That is right, and doctors are urging people to uh, hopefully avoid those potential dangers and eliminate any possibilities of burns this coming weekend. We sat down with Dr. Littleton with Batner's General. He's a surgeon who specializes in burn care, and he says they see an increase in patients coming in this time of year with burns. So how do you know when and if you should get seen by a doctor? Dr. Littleton says burns are divided into three categories. First degree burns are superficial like a sunburn and can be treated at home and second degree burns are a bit deeper. Third degree burns go through the full thickness of the skin all the way down to the fat and muscle below. Second and third degree burns typically require treatment. If you have a small minor burn and you could probably put some antibiotic uh, ointment on it, uh, but if you have pain that's not tolerable, uh, that is not manageable by taking over-the-counter pain medication like Tylenol or Advil, then you should probably seek care. Experts say you should keep pot holders, towels, and food packaging away from the stove top. If something is burning in a pot or a pan, don't try to carry it outside. Trips and spills while transporting these burning items result in serious burns for not only the person carrying it, but for maybe children or other people in your pathway when you get outside. But of course, burns happen outside of the kitchen as well. We'll talk more about that coming up in about 30 minutes. Dr. Steve.